I'm not too happy today. I know all good things have to come to an end. Neither am I. But you know what? We got to do this one last time. It's been such a fun episode. I know. Let's go for the last time once again. All right. So this time around, it's my turn, right? But before that, <laughs> welcome back to Poker Bazi's Box of Business with Poker Tank. And in this box, we've got some poker terminologies, and I'm going to pick one up this time around. And for the last time, I'm going to try to relate it to a business analogy. And that also in 30 seconds. All right. So let's go for it. Let's see what you get this time. Ooh, guess what I picked up, Muskan? Tell. Okay. Time starts now. All right. So tells are something which are very popular in poker. It can be physical or it can be through a betting pattern, and it gives away the strength of the person's hand. It can sometimes be weak or it can be strong. Similarly, in business, you know, during negotiations, you can actually look at the person and understand if he's strong or weak, or if he really wants to do a deal or not. And I actually have a very important story to tell you about Macau. Right when I was heads up with another player, there was huge money up top between the first and second. There was a big difference, and I wanted to make an even chop. However, the, my opponent said, "You know what? Give him more because he's a better player." And he, he asked me to look him up online, and I told him, "You know what? It didn't really matter." I saw the fear in his eyes, and I knew he was trying to pull a bluff. So I looked at him and I said, "You know what? Forget the deal. Let's just go play for all the money." He turned around and said, "Let's do the deal." I went with the physical deal, and that's how I got my deal. And I use this in the game of life too. Cool story, bro. But you just lost the game. Ah. <laughs> that was too long, but perfect. Like they say that if you play your cards right, you play the game of life right. I hope you learned a lot of lessons about business, poker, and life. And like they say in Poker Bazi, you hold the cards. This game may be habit-forming or financially risky. Play responsibly.